Objective To study about nutrition in human beings, the human digestive system. The human digestive system consists of the alimentary canal and digestive glands. The alimentary canal or gastrointestinal tract is a long, coiled, muscular tube extending between the mouth and the anus. Mouth is a transverse slit or aperture bordered by two soft and fleshy lips or labia. Mouth leads into the buccal cavity. The teeth and a muscular tongue are located in this cavity. The buccal cavity opens into the pharynx. The pharynx is a common chamber for the passage of food and air. Pharynx leads into the esophagus, also called the food pipe. Esophagus opens into the stomach. Stomach The stomach is a J-shaped muscular bag-like structure. It has a thick muscular wall that helps in churning the food and mixing it with the enzymes. Small intestine Small intestine is the longest part of the human alimentary canal. It is distinguishable into three regions, a C-shaped duodenum, a long-coiled middle portion jejunum, and a highly coiled ileum. Ileum is the longest part of the small intestine. It opens into the large intestine. The mucosa of small intestine shows many folds called villi. The villus is the finger-like process or fold of the mucosal layer of the small intestine into its lumen. It contains an arteriole, branch of an artery, a venule, a branch of a vein, and a lacteole, a lymph vessel. The cells lining the villi produce numerous microscopic projections called microvilli, giving a brush border appearance. These modifications increase the surface area enormously. The small intestine completes digestion of proteins, carbohydrates, fats and nucleic acids. It absorbs nutrients into blood and lymph. The length of the small intestine differs in various animals depending on the food they eat. Herbivores like rabbit have a long small intestine to allow the cellulose present in their diet to be digested. Meat is easier to digest, hence carnivores like tigers have a shorter small intestine. The digestive glands The digestive glands in man include three pairs of salivary glands liver, pancreas, gastric and intestinal glands. The salivary glands produce saliva. It contains amylase for the digestion of starch. It also contains lysozyme that kills bacteria present in the food. The liver produces bile juice. Bile does not contain any enzymes but is essential for the digestion of fats. Bile salts present in the bile juice emulsify fats, breaking them into smaller molecules. This is similar to the emulsifying action of soap on dirt. The pancreas produces the pancreatic juice. It contains enzymes like trypsinogen, chymotrypsinogen, carboxypeptidase, amylase, lipase or stepsin, and nucleases. The inner mucosal lining of the stomach has gastric glands that secrete acidic gastric juice. The pH is 0.9 to 1.8. The gastric juice contains HCL, pepsinogen, and small amounts of lipase. Prorenin is present only in the stomach of infants. HCL activates pepsinogen into pepsin and prorenin into renin. HCL also kills bacteria present in the food and provides acidic medium for the activity of the gastric enzymes. The thick layer of mucus and the bicarbonates present in the gastric juice protect the wall of the stomach from the acid. Mucosa of small intestine forms crypts in between the bases of the villi. These are called crypts of Libricun. The secretions of the brush border cells of the mucosa 
along with the secretions of the intestinal glands, constitute the intestinal juice, or succus entericus, with pH 7.8. Succus entericus contains a variety of enzymes, like disaccharidases, maltase, sucrase, lactase, aminopeptidases, dipeptidases, lipases, nucleotidases, nucleosidases, enterokinase, and mucus. The alimentary canal, or gastrointestinal tract, is a long, coiled, muscular tube extending between the mouth and the anus. The pharynx is a common chamber for the passage of food and air. The stomach is a J-shaped muscular bag-like structure. It has a thick muscular wall that helps in churning the food and mixing it with the enzymes. Small intestine Small intestine is the longest part of the human alimentary canal. It is distinguishable into three regions. A C-shaped duodenum, a long-coiled middle portion jejunum, and a highly coiled ileum. The small intestine completes digestion of proteins, carbohydrates, fats, and nucleic acids. It absorbs nutrients into blood and lymph. The liver produces bile juice. Bile does not contain any enzymes, but is essential for the digestion of fats. Bile salts present in the bile juice emulsify fats, breaking them into smaller molecules. This is similar to the emulsifying action of soap on dirt. HCL activates pepsinogen into pepsin and prorenin into renin. HCL also kills bacteria present in the food and provides acidic medium for the activity of the gastric enzymes. Succus entericus contains a variety of enzymes like disaccharidases, maltase, sucrase, lactase, aminopeptidases, dipeptidases, lipases, nucleotidases, nucleosidases, enterokinase, and mucus.